So, um, welcome to, 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 to this tutorial. So, uh, basically, we are going to look at how to use the skin uh, finer tool, yeah, which is uh, an extension in uh, Photoshop. So, uh, with me is, is an image that I took in uh, 2019. Yeah, so um, I've opened it in Camera Raw filter. This is Camera Raw filter, the one that is found in uh, Photoshop 2018. So uh, here we are not going to do much of the things, but we're just going to do one or two things like balancing the color and just uh, brightening it up. So basically, I love. Uh, let's let me just click the auto, the auto um, tool so that uh, it, it's it's able to to do the magic. So this is it. Then um, uh, in order for, for, for the skin finer to work well, we need to, to have a distinction. Like there has to be a difference between the background and the face. So let's just uh, let's just put it a little bit of a distance, like just a little bit of a difference. Okay. That is that is that okay so, okay so, okay so okay so we 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 are done then let's eat the let's eat the the, the, the okay button i think this is okay Okay, this is okay. So let's eat the open. Let's open it then and um, apply the skin finer too. So let me, let's just wait for it to load a little bit. So uh, what I love doing is duplicating the layer. So how to duplicate the layer is simply command. It's simply Control J. Sorry. So let's zoom it a little bit. Let's zoom the face. So here, one thing that we are going to do is, as you can see, the face has black spots. So we go to the 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 the, the spot healing tool. Then uh, we click where there are unwanted spots, like unwanted spots. So uh, this image was was taken by um, Kasman. Yeah, Kasman Arts is is a friend of mine. He does photography. He's a friend of mine. He does photography. So yeah, he took this image in 20, 20, 2019, in the year twenty nineteen. <laughs> by that time, we were both in college. So he was getting rid of the spots like the unwanted parts okay okay i think that's all so as you can see i know you're unable to see much difference there because uh the lady we've used as a model she doesn't have too much black spots on her face but at least we've managed to move a few okay so the next thing that we need to do here now is go to filter filter then we go to uh, come down and go to photo photo to box then you're going to find the extension of uh, the skin uh, finer to then you click on it just, let's just wait for it to um, you know load a little bit okay pardon my laptop it's, it's a little bit slow okay so in skin uh, finer this is the before this is the after so when we go to this box uh, on our left side and not on our right side on our left side you're going to see to say um, there is this space which is marked black because when we look at the original photo when we look at the original photo you're going to see this is the original photo then when we mark the preview mask we're going to find to say all these spaces which are marked black are not affected by this skin finer too but these uh, spaces which are looking normal which are original are the ones that are affected by the 
skin finer too so in order for us to like adjust you know in order for us to adjust what we simply do is uh go to uh the skin uh, skin color there is what is basically called uh, the, 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 the the expand and uh, the, the exclude so when we go to the expand you're going to see that this space here is 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 is, is, is was black but we're going to select it because we want the entire face to get affected by the skin finer to then when we look at the the air of the lady okay of the model <laughs> So uh, we're going to see that the, the, the hair, the wig is whirling and um, the skin, they're a little bit similar. So we need to be so conscious with that one. Then let's just select even. So we need to be careful in selecting these parts because we are going to find to say we'll end up selecting the faces. But certain times it's not every detail in the background that is uh selected so some details in the background are affected by the skin finer it depends with the type of a background but that you have okay so let's just zoom it in okay let's zoom it let's zoom it then let us deselect this one we selected it but let us deselect it okay so let's zoom it in again <coughs> there we go there we go so uh we are able to see the difference between the before and the after so after this is done i love the golden color that is coming out of the skin that is that is lovely so what we now do here is go to apply and select the eye the smooth eye, the smoothing eye so from there we select it okay let's just uh, let's let's minimize this and let's maximize the skin detail so on the skin detail let let us put the amount the smoothing in amount to 100 but it depends with the type of work that you are working on <clears throat> some 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 photographers prefer they prefer it depends with the type of photo that you are working on and the type of uh, model that you have so so it depends with what your eyes best love so <clears throat> okay so we are going to see to say there are some spaces which are yet not affected by the skin uh finer so we are going to go on so make sure as you are moving the 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 cursor uh you need to be looking at your, your 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 left part so that you'll be seeing the spaces which have been affected and which are not being affected okay so there we go boom okay so this is excellent okay so we are able to see the distinction between the two the before and the after between these two uh the the, 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 the two images that are on the screen so we are going to see that this the skin has been smoothened so 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 nice and you're able to see that she's now looking more gorgeous and more beautiful okay that is that is excellent work there i love the golden color that is coming out of her skin so this is the before and that is the after then after this is done let us minimize the skin detail then we can maximize the, the skin tone if you want the skin tone to be uh to be a little bit worked on as you can see um that is the original then this is the one that we've worked on so we can we can play around with this and balance up the skin tone okay so we can balance this a little bit uh, well though i don't really love playing around with this <laughs> they confuse me sometimes they confuse me sometimes i don't really love to to play around with this okay i think this is much much better so as we can see the model is looking beautiful we can now click okay okay so let's just wait for it to load a little bit let's wait for it to load a little bit so this is how the skin refiner works this is how the skin finer works let's zoom it let's zoom it and see how the details have come out you would 
able to see that the details have come out so 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 definite this is the before and this is the after wow beautiful beautiful work out there beautiful work out there you're able to see that is the before that is the after okay that is some amazing work amazing work there so thank you for staying tuned thank you for watching this tutorial my name is Musonda Mandona please subscribe and keep watching leave a comment and tell me what you think about this tutorial thank you